studios of Carl Middle School to Connecticut, America, Planet Earth, and the Milky Way, this is UMass Student News. CMS. I'm Mr. Kiss, and I am not in the CMS studios, but in my living room. This is a special edition of the CMS Student News. Our show will hopefully help with the implementation of distance learning. A good tip is you start each day by creating a schedule about what you're going to be doing for the day. For example, you can go right now to the CMS Student News Google Classroom page. There, you'll find a blank schedule. Take it if you want and uh, sit down when you get ready to start your day, say around nine o'clock, and fill it out and decide what you want to accomplish that day. It can include things like things for your classes, like reading, social studies, math, etc. When you're going to maybe do some exercise, your meals, things like that. It'll help you organize your plans. Look at the screen right now. Um, you can see some schedules that are posted. Um, there's a couple here. You might want to pause this video so you can take a closer look at them. For example, one is from some students from ECS and WIS named uh, Gavin and Avery. Uh, we encourage you to start your day by filling out a plan or a schedule like this, like these. If you do, take a screenshot of the schedule that you made each day or any day. Post a screenshot on the CMS Student News Google Classroom page so other people can kind of get a look at what you're doing. And a special thanks to Mrs. Delarada for helping out with this segment. Now, to talk a little bit more about distance learning, we go to Mr. St. Ange and Amelia. Hello, Mr. St. Ange. Hello, CMS. This is Mr. St. Ange reporting from home in his distance learning classroom. We've got Amelia who is hard at work currently. She is grading your assignments on your distance learning classroom page. She's liking what she's seeing so far. She hopes that everybody eventually starts to get on his distance classroom and start putting in the hard work. Please let me know if you guys have any questions about anything. On Wednesday, the CIAC stated that it is not yet ready to cancel the spring sports season. For more, we go to the Cromwell Middle School Athletic Director, Mr. Penny, about this. He's going to talk about the possibility of a spring sports season and how to keep in touch with him during this time. Mr. Penny. Good morning, Cromwell Middle School. Hope everyone's doing well in this time of uncertainty and stress. Um, just giving an update on spring sports. I know uh, the CIAC has postponed the high school spring season indefinitely. Um, as you know, we kind of run by the under the guidance of the CIAC. So obviously, our spring season is also postponed, but I just wanted you to know, um, unfortunately, there's no guarantee that we will have a spring season, but in case we do, um, I have set up a spring sports sign-up Google Classroom. The code is 2EGON75. You can get on there and you know, you can sign up for the sport that you'd like to play this spring. Remember, baseball is only for boys in seven and eight. Um, softball and track is open to all grades, six, seven, and eight. Um, if you have any questions about spring sports or anything, just email me. Um, I'm checking my email regularly at school at home. Um, if it's a question about spring sports, if it's a question about phys ed or anything, feel free to contact me via email. Hope you guys are all well. Hope you're staying safe and exercising. Talk to you later. Bye. One task you should be completing daily is reading. Whether it's reading for your core classes or just your independent reading. If you're looking for stuff to read, Mrs. Stearns, our library media specialist, shared a free, we all like free, reading source. The website is called um, JLG Digital. 
The web address is on the screen right there. The address is jlg.ipublishcentral.com. Mrs. Stern's got access to the site. You will need a username and password to access all of the reading materials on there. I posted that on the CMS Student News Google Classroom page. You can go there now and get the access. They seem to have tons of stuff to read, and it's all free. And now, let's check out Miss Sales. She has a special announcement. Thank you, CMS. That is our show. Good morning and have a pleasant Friday.